Hello everybody, good morning, good evening, wherever you are in the world. Welcome back to the ESC Scott YouTube channel for another Junior Eurovision reaction video. Today we're going to be reacting to North Macedonia's entry for this year's contest and it is Tamara Grujeska. We've known that it's going to be her for quite a while and the song is called Kazimi Kazimi Koi. That's what I'm going to go with. So without further ado, let's play the intro. This is an entry I've actually been really looking forward to listening to because I've been seeing Tamara's Instagram um, and it's just her singing like past Eurovision entries, past uh, Macedonian entries and her voice is absolutely exquisite. It's so, so blabbing good. It's really good. Her voice is like amazing live. I'm so hoping for this song to be so good. I'm really, really looking forward to it. Quite, kind of an unpopular opinion but I actually really enjoyed North Macedonia's entry last year. I really, really, really enjoyed it. I thought it was a bop. So I'm wondering what route Tamara is going to go down here. Let's find out. I'm just going to get right into it. AirPod is in. Let's do it. Right, let's press play. Now, here we go. Heroes. Let's do it. Come on. We know her voice is amazing. I'm just so hoping the song's going to be so good. I want the Macedonian win. Okay. Already love the beginning. Some breathy vocals. Is this another ballad though? <laughs> another ballad? Okay. Her voice is amazing. This is promising. Okay. Okay. Right, let's see if this picks up. This this actually is quite promising. Power. Her voice is powerful as heck. Okay, it's a cool video as well. Seems actually they put made use of the budget. Oh, I like that. Sounds quite ethnic. Oh yeah. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Oh, the main thing about this is just her voice. Her voice is amazing. So it's sung in, is it Macedonian? Let me just check. Okay, so it's sung in Macedonian and English. Okay. We've got a clown. Randomly. It seems like all the countries are trying to involve the kind of colour painful kind of thing that happened for the theme this year. Okay. I can see us becoming quite catchy. Everyone's going to be singing it. Yeah, North Macedonia's putting some effort in this year. I like this bit. This bit's the catchy bit. Okay. It does sound quite ethnic. Stop splashing on her face with like that powder stuff. What the hell? That was a cool video. I actually quite enjoyed that. Okay, so yet again, another country doing something completely different to last year. It seemed like last year we had a kind of a lot of upbeat pop songs that were like quite adultish almost. Like you'd hear it in like the charts. In, in the UK, but this year during Eurovision, a lot of the entries are quite a lot of ballads. We're getting a lot of ballads and a lot of native sounding songs. So this is definitely something I think like the sound of this is just so interesting and it's something I actually quite love and I would love to see an adult Eurovision from North Macedonia. What I love about junior Eurovision is that the song has to be 66%. I think it's 60 or 66 or 60% of the song has to be in 
a native language. So I love that that's a rule because we get to hear the country's sound, we get to hear that and it's, it's integrated into this music, it's so good. And somehow they've made it catchy for even a Scottish person to like, it's, it is really good. I don't know if it's my favourite yet, I think this is one of the ones where I'd need to keep listening to it for it to move higher, higher, higher in my top. But this is like, yeah, I, I, it lived up to my expectations. So thank you North Macedonia, you've done it. Now just do it in normal Eurovision this year and we'll be happy. But tell me what you think of the song down below in the comments. Remember to like this video and subscribe if you want more junior Eurovision content. There's lots more coming up. Italy's reactions coming up, Portugal's coming up, Estonia is coming up, UK, Armenia. They're all coming up and it's so exciting. I can't wait for Armenia's song, can't wait for the UK's song. I'm really excited for the UK's song. But, um, thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.